easily got five points in a row in that rotation that time. France got out of it the first time. Overpass for France. Back to Boye, and he goes down the line, but that's picked up by Belasso. Michieletto taking a little step back and a swing on that. Ball to the outside, off the block, but recovered. Oh, Domenico with a fake out set. He is a top level libero, he plays in Chivatanova, Italian champion club. Spirito. Again, this time it's off the net to France. Blocked, but it's picked up and kept alive. Gets it back, gives it to his setter, but that ball is out, so set point goes the way of France. Still at the service line. Comes to Chile. Brizard pushes that outside. Good reception from Italy. Altolo gets it back. A quick ball into the hands and out. And that'll do it for Italy. That ball into the block. Hi, and Boye manages to pick that point up off of Recine, but nobody's really sure where that ball went. It's that underway. Picked up. Ali into the hands of the block and down on his own court. It's a great serve from Grizzard. A short serve to position two. There are three players in that small area and trying to decide who should play it in the short amount of time is... France again. Surf. Into the middle of Vitelli. Off the hands and out. So Italy's on the board. French blocker ready for that. They've been focused on blocking that ball since the start of the match. Incidentally, they won that set. Diaz. Outside, off the hands. Leto's under that. Regine, straight cross court, right past the block. Those angles are incredible. He jumps so early that he has a chance to turn his body, turn his shoulder. The control from Micheletto was great. Lips it over, and there's nobody in sight. Normally that belongs to the middle blocker, but the middle was not even anywhere in sight. All five players have to be ready to receive, but there are a couple of rotations where there's literally not. Been this time, 7 0. Sometimes off the net, but Tilly into the hands and covered by the setter. Diaz will set. Off the hands and out, picked up by Nelly. High ball outside to Recine, who goes into the hands and down. A huge block by France in this fifth set. That would well have been a big moment in the set. Italy. Okay. Giletto off. Tip there and France. We'll go again. Oh yeah, this time into the main block of Cortesia and Recine. A monster block for Italy this time. It was a really good block. Cortesia waited for that. He saw it early and he executed perfectly. 5-3 for Italy. Cortesia's. Zard finds the pipe and Cleveno against that block going across his shoulder to the other side. It's the play that setters use when they're in that position on the court. It's a riskier set. They can make the block of respect to the middle of the court still. And there's definitely some respect there through the middle. Full toward, jumps, full. Yeah, serve. 
takes that. And Boye goes straight past the Italian block down to the sideline. That was a better block from Micheletto. Micheletto able to get out of the reception lineup there. Bringing him up past. A little high five between Recine and Micheletto there. He's so high that the blockers have to reach. That serve to Tilly. That's into the middle and blocked. So a joust to the net off the hands of the Italian side. So France take that point. And as Bultor will confirm when he goes back to the bench and after this possible serve. Strong serve to Recine. But nevertheless, Micheletto high and deep over the block and into the end line, into the corner. Bultor. Going for that sideline again, it's worked really well for him. Six. Goes for Tilly. Pull of hands there, good defense on the Italian side. Dirito picking that up is Micheletto in the backcourt. Down the side, Nelly somehow finding the hands of that block. The thing I like most about Micheletto's game from what I've seen of him is his control of the defence, how he moves around in the backcourt, two plays in that rally after the... Top spin. Controlled by Tilly. Down the line and Cleveno finding a way through that, just right down the side of that block between the antenna. Wants to get involved. Get the set close to the antenna. Let's see if Rizad is short indeed. He clips the net. Ali looking for the end line there. That was a very close to call. Okay, so he's looking for a touch. Ali. Diaz. Rizad finds the pipe. And Tilly coming in hot from the backboard. He really came steaming in on that. Steam on this sword. It's over. Picked up. Rizad. Outside and off the hands. Another hot and steamy swing from Kevin Tilly. Alesso made the mistake in defense here. He took a step forward as the See it there. We're 10 11 now in the fifth set. Oh, no. Taking some heat off of that. Machine able to control it and goes off the hands of Boye and out of bounds. So the point goes to Italy. Machine 10 points on the board now. Previous rally he tipped and he certainly wasn't going to make that mistake again. And Nelly, he has one ace already on the board. Goes for Clevino. Yeah, into the hands. That's recycled. Goes out of basketball outside. Tilly who goes directly over his shoulder. Down the line. Crispy. That time there was a defender on the line. Normally you see that line completely unattended. But it was too fast. For Nelly. The reception from Clevino was exceptional. Okay. Serve. into the block and down, and he's doing a fantastic job of putting points on the board for Italy in this set. French block is ready for that play. They're ready to stay in front of the setter, but he's just onto it so fast that Bultor doesn't have time. Levino play that again. But through the middle, Bultor picks up his 13th point of the match. Uses Cortesia. Free ball is not sent back to Italy. The miscommunication by France in exactly the wrong moment. 
moment. Italy, match point now against France. Italy. Retour. Putting that ball up, but it's taken. Kept alive and off the hands, and it's Italy! The young squad of Italy who put the ball away and take the fifth set against France. What an incredible play by the young squad of Italy. Handing France their fourth defeat in this 2021 BNL.